First at six tonight, developing news out of Alexandria, where police are investigating the death of a woman as a homicide. Her body was found inside her home on Derby Court. Tonight, lots of questions about what happened and who may be responsible. Richard Reeves spoke with the woman's family. He's live tonight in Alexandria with the latest. Rich? Well, Rebecca, the victim's family says they are as mystified as anyone else. A family member found that woman inside a bedroom. No outward sign of trauma, they say. No sign of a break-in. Yet authorities are calling this a homicide. The Brookdale Apartments off Derby Court in Alexandria. Seems pretty safe. Yeah, it seems pretty safe. Yeah, it is. Where police are trying to solve the murder of 43-year-old Asabich Abene Warku. Neighbors are shocked about a homicide in their midst. I mean, it's quiet. I never, I never heard like a problem or something like that before. Alexandria police were called to this apartment on the 5600 block after a family member discovered Worku's body in a bedroom Friday morning. I can tell everyone was confused, wondering what was going on. Police initially called this a death investigation, but now say it's a homicide case. Family members say there was no sign of a break-in, but also say the victim, in her 40s, suffered a head injury during a taxicab accident about a week ago. Still, no one expected this. It's hard to even think something like that could happen right here. You know, I mean, this neighborhood isn't perfect, but it's, you know, it's, it's pretty, it's real nice, actually. Police have not released a cause of death and aren't saying if foul play is suspected. Neighbors like Jose Quintero say they will now be more cautious. Yeah, I keep my eyes open. I make sure my balcony doors are locked. I mean, I have two dogs in my house too, so I feel a lot safer. Worku's family is hoping for answers after the autopsy results come back. Uh, we're told that she was a very religious woman, that she worked as a chef in a local restaurant, and that family says they want answers. If you have any information, you're asked to call Alexandria Police. Live in Alexandria, Richard Reeve, ABC7 News.